Hey everybody, it's Richard Aramore at Diag, and today we're having a look at a uh, one series BMW with a suspected timing fault. Right, okay, so get rid of that glare. We've got a few codes in this. we got got um, camshaft displacement, inlet camshaft control, and we've got some misfire codes as well. So what I've been asked to do is have a look and see if we can work out if there's a timing issue with this car. Um, I'm already into this, uh, so I've got an in-cylinder test already done. It's got it up on the screen there. Um, this is sort of ringing a few alarm bells already. I've got sort of leaning towers on the compression peaks there. And I do have some uneven pockets. Um, I haven't put this on uh, on any other software to uh, check all the opening times and stuff. Um, but from there, what I've done, so we've got the old Pico out and got into the ECU here and we got it back probed into the crankshaft sensor and both the camshaft sensors and what we've got is I've done a comparison with a known good so if we just look here I've just put up a couple of rulers and just notice the amount of teeth on this crankshaft one at the top and then what I'm going to do is if I open the other page and get my other one back up here and then the same comparison this is the car this is the actual car that I've been testing and these are in the same place we've got about three teeth here that are being shown if we go to the known good up here and what we've got one two three four five nearly six teeth there on the difference I've measured this in a few different places and it looks like both of these cams are out in comparison to the crankshaft. So I think from that and the in-cylinder test it looks a bit wonky as well. I think that's going to um, warrant a, a strip down on this and check what the timing's doing. Um, you know, get the, um, the proper locking tools, see what happens. So uh, yeah, just a real quick one, but I thought that would be quite interesting for everyone to see. Just a comparison on uh, a cam crankshaft synch synchronization. Um, cheers for watching and come along for the next one.